And here we are here at the Michigan Race for the Cup Series on the Monday. Yep, the Mother Nature Rain had to postpone the race till Monday. So yeah, at least I'm not at school anymore so I can watch the race. And right now, um, Brad Kosowski is in first. Yes. But he's going to have to go to pit road soon because since... You guys saw in the Arca Series Xfinity, and now today these guys are gonna have to do pits. So, yeah. Fortunately, he's gonna have to give up the lead. Hammonds in second, William Byron third, Ryan Priest fourth. Yeah. And, um. If you guys, in case if you guys haven't been watching the. I Anthony, um. What's it? The I Anthony Michigan reactions. Which, by the way, shout out to I Anthony, and you should go subscribe to his channel. He's well above a thousand subscribers. I don't even know how many subscribers he's at, but he's well above one thousand. But yeah, you should go subscribe to him. He's a cool dude, and um, I was in the part of his stream in the last like about like sixty to like right now twenty laps, and I had to leave because to do my own reactions here on my channel. So yeah. But it was really fun hanging out with all the other people on Discord that were on the like, voice chat. Yeah. And this, and actually, about this race, Michigan, it's actually not been a bad race. I mean, like, even though with all the single file racing and everything, it's still pretty exciting. At least the top five is keeping up with the leader because of the package that they have. So, yeah, at least it, make, it makes things a little bit more exciting. So, yeah. Um, right now, they're the leaders before they went down pit road, Lugano, Truex, and Bush. I don't know if Kyle Bush and Bowman are a part of me, uh, a part of this now, but oh well. Um, Hammond is right now the leader, Corey the Joy has went, has gone down pit road. So apparently it seems like Ryan Priest, William Byron, and Danny Hammond haven't pitted. And then Kyle Busch and Bowman are now going to be behind the top three. There is Denny Hammond pitting now. Now all we need is William Byron to pit and Ryan Priest. Uh, unless they save on fuel. Which Tyler Reddick, wait was it Tyler Reddick? Yeah it was Tyler Reddick. And um, Ty Majeski have been doing. And only one time it didn't work, and another time it did. So yeah, it's a tough, it's a, it's a toss up between it could happen or it could not happen for both William Byron or or Ryan Priest. But like 16 laps to go, so they probably won't be able to make it on fuel unless they pit. Yeah, Lexi. Yeah, William Byron pitting right now. And Priest, there you go. Alright, so now we're going to have a tight battle here for the win. Since everyone has pitted now, I'm pretty sure. Logano, Truex, Kurt Busch, Kyle Busch, and Alex Bowman. To get to... Just to tell you guys right now. Kyle Busch has not been in the top 10. Just, or at least he hasn't been in the top 5 at all. Before these guys went down pit road. And now he's in the top 5. How did that happen? I mean, like, William, um, Alex Bowman's in 5th, which is good. Brad Kisowski's in 7th, which is good. Um, let's see. Chris Buescher fell behind to 13th, which is bad. Larson fell back to 17th, which is worse. And Amarola fell to 19th, which, eh. But he was up in the top 10 before these guys went to pits. So yeah, Joe Logano, first place, Shoek second, and Kurt Busch third. Actually, this race just hasn't been a whole bunch of, as in, there hasn't been that many cautions in this race. I mean, like only a few. At the beginning of stage three, there was a uh, two wrecks between um, uh, Austin Dillon and Kim Boyer, and that's it. Earlier in the race, in like, stage one, the 51 of, I think, Kyle Benjamin, Hit the wall, I guess, and then his deck lid came off, and yeah, and the caution came out. No caution for debris. And also, I would have 
gladly liked if I was able to record with the voice chat of the Discord group. Um, still here from my Anthony's um server. But nope. Apparently every time when I try to make a recording with the Discord on, it doesn't let me. And so yeah, I apparently cannot do that unfortunately. I wish I could so that you guys can hear the other people's voices, but there were some swear words heard Wow, I was in the voice chat, so yeah. Oh, okay, so back to the race. Cars are slowing down Truex, which is helping Logano to pull away. Hmm. Bowman is like two and a half seconds behind. Which, I mean, like, at least he'll get a top 10 out of it. Even if he loses the top 5, he at least will still get a good finish out of it. Because Suarez is cashing up to him. Okay, so Truex has passed Bubble Walls, which is a couple of laps down. And there's just one more lap card so that Truex can get past and we'll see a battle between Truex and Nakano. Yet again, for the third time, and in the course of three races, or no, four races, Martinsville, Homestead, Richmond, and we will see it yet again here at Michigan. Well, I mean, Kurt Busch is right behind Truex. Kurt Busch can actually help Truex push him close to the gun, and there we will see the, the battle. For the win. Ten more to go here at Michigan, by the way. And now, up ahead of the Ghana, there doesn't seem like a whole bunch of lap cars. Only a couple. And those couple are really far away. So, yeah. That definitely benefits Truex and Bush. And then Brad Kisowski. He's been, like, in the top 20 in, like, in the last, like couple of laps before they went to pit road. Now he's up in the top 10, which is a major improvement in just in a couple of laps, but yeah, not good enough. Oh, they are sort of catching up to Logano, just a couple tenths of a second much faster, or a couple hundredths of a second. And then Kyle Bush up in fourth, from out of nowhere. I mean, like, where is Karen Harvick? He's in 8th place. He was up here in the last couple of laps before they went to pit road. Now he's over there at 7th and Kyle Busch in 4th. Why? And now Bowman's catching up to Kyle Busch. Hmm, okay, okay. I mean, like, from all these drivers in the top 5, the only ones I prefer to win, or at least I prefer to see win is Kurt Busch and Alex Bowman, that's it. Delgano is eh, and then Truex, I mean like, okay, but Kyle Busch, yeah, definitely not. Just Bowman, at least please push Kyle Busch to the front and then pass him at the last second when you're about to catch to all these three guys. Seven to go. Alright, so now Kurt Busch and Truex are within a second behind, less than a second behind Logano. They're certainly catching up. There's some um, Harvick and Kisowski battling it out side by side for 7th place with 7 to go. For plus 2, 6, and there's about to be 6 steps to go. Boom. Now these guys are definitely catching up. They're half a second behind Nogano. Kyle Busch and Bowman are not helping each other, so yeah. Sucks to be them. Alright, now we're gonna have we're now we're gonna see an epic battle for the win. Obviously Kamikaze Games is gonna be rooting for Logano. I'm not Logano, True X. Probably just made Kamikaze Games disappointed because I said that. And I'm pretty sure he's not gonna be disappointed. Be not gonna be disappointed because he's not even watching for sure. Yeah. Yeah. 
Five more laps to go here in Richmond. Why did I say Richmond? Up in Michigan. Oh, here comes Truex. Not, it's not here comes Truex, it's here's Truex. He's right there. Falling, but he's right there. Definitely losing gap to Logano. He was in the 20s, now he's in the 30s. And now there's lap, lap traffic up ahead. Up and there, there goes Jones around! The caution gonna come out. He's in the grass, but he's around. Where's the caution? There is the caution. The flipping caution that with four laps to go. Oh my goodness gracious. We're, we're gonna be in for an epic finish here, boys and girls, ladies, and gentlemen. Wow. Eric Jones, I don't know either to say thank you or no thank you because I honestly don't know what's gonna happen here. Moment fifth, Kurt Bush third, Flora sixth, Dusky eighth. Larson not gonna get the win anymore, but yeah. There's a caution night not lit yet. Oh, oh, never mind. They were talking about Eric Jones. Yeah, he had just he just had a fat tire. He just had a flat tire and then Precious spun it in the apron. Yep. Yep. Oh, he almost came back across the track and then Jimmy and Amorola. Why did I see one person with their first name and then another person with their last name? Johnson and Amorola or Jimmy and Eric. Boom. So yeah, caution out. Three to go. I don't know if it could be overtime this time next time by, but this is gonna be crazy here no matter what. Oh man, oh man. Let's just see what will happen in the restart. Here we go, coming into the restart zone for overtime. Let's go. Logano on the outside. Truex on the inside. Green flag in the air and Logano going way too fast I guess. Whatever, green. Truex immediately blocked Kyle Busch's line. So thank you, Truex, for doing that. Now Kyle Busch cannot get a perfect start. Oh, Kyle Busch pushing Suarez all the way up high. Oh, man. It's going to be crazy right here. Oh, man. Wow, Kyle Busch. Thank goodness. He's falling all the way to the back. Yay. Here comes Kurt Busch on the bottom of Truex. Woohoo! Here they come. Final lap here in Michigan. Seems like Kurt Busch is gonna want this win. Final lap. Can Chip Ganassi go back in victory lane here in Michigan? Kurt looking high. The gun blocks. Kurt looking low. Oh ho! Kurt is hungry for this win. Into the back straight away. Kurt. Drafting. Here they come. Shell Pencil Ford versus Monster Chevy. Here they come. Who's gonna win it? Kurt looking up high. Oh! I don't think it's enough. Logano is going to win here in Michigan. Wow. Okay. Not bad. Kurt Bush tried to win it. But wow. Joey Logano, it was, I mean, he was just the dominant car this whole entire race. I mean, like, it would be obvious that he would win. Kurt Busch, I was seeing him to win. I was, I was looking out for Kurt Busch on these final two laps since, final lap since he passed Truex. But wow. Kurt Busch will get second, and yay, Kyle Busch will get fifth. Ha, take that. Bowman. He's only like in the top five and he finished ten. Oh, okay, so here's what happened. I mean, like, Logano just won and that gave the opportunity for Truex to block Kyle and that on the outside. So, so thank you, Truex, for blocking Kyle so that Kyle wouldn't have an amazing start. And then there's the margin. Wasn't a photo finish, but there's the margin. There goes Logano burning it down in Michigan. And you guys already know Kamikaze is going to be angry about this just because they're going to won. Oh well, it is what it is. What happened, happened. 
cannot change it. Whatever. And Logano with the Ford, the manufacturer rights, or whatever is going on with these manufacturers in Michigan. Logano with the Ford is going to win in Michigan. Not bad. Not bad at all. I mean, like, he was going to win anyway, probably. I wonder what would have happened if it wasn't a caution. Would have Logano won? Would have Truex won? Would have Kurt won? Mm -mm. Oh well. Just wow. Congratulations to Joe Logano for winning at Michigan. I mean, like, he pretty much deserved it. He was the dominant one here in Michigan. There he goes, getting out of the car. Just wow. So this is like, what, the second win of the season? Yeah, second win of the season. Win it as Vegas, and then won it again here in Michigan. Wow. Well, that's going to be it for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I hope everyone enjoyed. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. This is Rising Fan 24042 here. And see you guys later.